okay? So if you could take me for what he said I am, I will take you for who you are. I respect you so much. And I only have for respect and trust in return. I don't think I've asked for too much. Ask me, man. Yeah, you're asking me to trust you, and, and all I'm asking is for some identification Calvin, before I, I send out I thousands of dollars to someone I've never met. Calvin, Calvin, I am saying you can trust me. You can trust me. I am trustable. I trusted you. That is why I didn't trust you when I was approving your bill. Okay, I stood for you when the board met to discuss. I stood for you, and I made sure that you have your, your facility. That is trust to a man I've never met. The same trust that I exuded over you for what it was. Why don't you extend it to me too? Since I've never doubted you as a man, why are you doubting me? Okay, so you will do me honor and the same honor I will extend to you then I will open business relationship with you. Okay, even in the US by going to the bank now, transfer the money to me, then we sell, we sell a bond that you can't even understand where we begin to reach from. That is what I have to feel. Great. Try and understand me. Okay. okay. Well, uh, uh, look at it from my point of view, okay? Here it is, uh, somebody, a, a company um, of gross incompetence, because I'm afraid it took so many months for, for this to get done, that they, they finally send me a check, and uh, they want me to send it to some strange company and they refuse to give me very basic information about the companies they want me to send the money to. And then when I ask someone who's supposedly a worldly, educated, first-class flyer to give me his driver's license, well, you claim that you don't have it with you. Now, I'm sorry, Ray, but I'm going to either need to see your driver's license, or you're going to have to answer some basic questions about the three companies you want me to send money to. It is not a problem, okay? If you are not comfortable with that, do you want to send it to somewhere else? Do you want to do that? Well, it, I want to send it no. to... Uh, wait a minute, that's no. silly. You're not going to have me send it to somewhere else. I, I tell you what. No, I'm not, no. Here, here's the third. You want a third option? Okay, because your first option was to answer my questions. You can't do that. Your second option no. was to send me your driver's license. You can't do that. So here's no, a no, third no. option. You, you want a third option? And he hung up. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hello, Colin. Yes, is this uh, Ray? Yeah, that's Ray. Okay, good. All right. Okay, um, Rahman, Rahman wants to he wants to speak with you. He wants to what? Hello, Mr. Carvin. Yes, hi. I I want you to tell me what the problem is. Maybe I can solve it for you. Well, uh, basically, I have three options for uh, Ray Gavin. He can either uh, answer my questions about the company that he wants me to send money to. There are three companies, and I need answers to all three of them. Uh, you know about, you know, uh, what's the money for? Uh, where the, um, where's the uh, company address? That kind of thing. You know, just information, basic information about the companies. Uh, you know, I spoke with him before he called you back. I really asked him that what is the problem. And he told me that he gave you some loan, you are winning about $40,000 and you have paid some commission and you have to send some money to some other um, people, important people in China. You see, what I understand about the little thing from experience that I've been into business now for the past 15 years, worldwide, I've been to the U.S. before. I was in the U.S. in the year 2004. I was in the U.S. I have a couple of friends in the U.S. and all over the world. What I understand is this. In a business like this, in a transaction like this, you know people who are learning. I'm uh, talking about the lawyers, the Anton. They like to keep some information to themselves privately. Because I believe what they have done to you is to help you settle the debt that you are holding. And you have to make some main payment to some other people. I don't see any problem in that. You see, everywhere all over the world, from what I told him now is this. There is a problem of illegal pr transaction at times in the world. And the best people to come back to that is the bank. Like my bank, I have about three banks in the world that I deal with. I keep that personal to myself now. Every time I want to make any transaction of two million, three million dollars, I make confirmation. I use a code to speak with them. And once they realize that I'm the one that issued it, they understand they don't verify too much. 
If what they have done to you, transferring money to your account is not well done legitimately, I don't think the money will come to you. Your bank must have confirmed it before the money comes to you. It is only from my, I'm not trying to insult you, please. This is our month of Ramadan. We don't talk something that is bad. If you, if you are really, really a big businessman, because the way you talk to me, I really like you. I like your voice. I've not seen you. I don't know your character. So I don't, I don't, I can't love you up to 50% until I deal with you. This man that is sitting down here with me, the Anthony, Mr. Ray, is the man that I've been talking to. And whenever he talks to me, he has a spirit of, you know, motivating business and letting me happy. So when I saw him in person and I spoke with him, I realized that he is just what he is. He's not trying to feign or to fake anything. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. What I would advise you to do is this. I know you have your own option. You have your own mind. Like when Muslim call it, we call it Mara. You have your own mind that you follow. But if you really want to show, if he has really done good to you, want to show him our precision, you should follow his instruction. Because he must have given a good instruction before this money comes to you. So why paying him back in such a way to stress him or let him be flying all over the world because he has the access of people like me and friends to go anywhere you want and to tell him to go back to, to the UK to bring you um, a document of license or what do what you ask him to send to you. He must have done some good confirmation. He must have, some, he must have provided some document before this money comes to your account. So the people that loan you the money have no problem than to, to face him. So if he has asked you to send the money to some place, it must have been for some personal. You don't expect me, like I'm talking to you, you don't expect me to disclose every business or every move I make to you because you are not part and parcel of the business it is only even like you as a person that i would tell you you should understand that there are some things that you do in your own business in your own company that you don't tell anybody even though your wife is asking you tell him about 65 or 70 percent that is life and that is the way almighty allah has asked us to do it so i wonder why you trying to stress this man on something that i can even pay off i'm not trying to brag there are some things that you show your integrity on so that business can continue about life. Do you understand? So if you are really skeptical about what he has been doing with you, why, the, why don't you have refused the loan that was given to you in the first place? I have given a loan to someone that I have not met before through my lawyer in Jordan. I have given a loan of 500 and, is it not 40,000 US dollars? And I have not met the person before. But I stand because my lawyer told me this person is his client. And I have to say, if you know that this money is going to be given back within the short period of time of 60 days, and we can loan this company, then they pay back with 5%. I don't even speak with the person. My lawyer stood and signed the agreement. And I said, okay, the money will be sent to, I got my bank that the, my, my bank should make the money payment to the, my lawyer, and the lawyer sent the money to the person. And after 60 days, I think they pay back 70 days after. And I was comfortable. So if he has told you to give some money to some people in the China business, which I have been to before, I know not much illegal goes in China. So you should be able to follow instruction and make the payment today because you know transactions like this take five to six days for confirmation. If you could make payment today to the bank in China, five days time they will make the confirmation. The more you delay him in the transaction, the more the demos. You should understand business like this. There is a constitution about loan. There is a rules and regulation about loan. When, when, when I wanted to start my business on my own in the year 1999, after starting my company, I went up with, I, I, I applied for a loan, and the loan was given to me in Hong Kong. And I made sure that the percentage and everything was clarified. There are sometimes you do business with people. Everywhere in the whole world, internet has really helped to make business so easier. If you do me anything, I have your details. If I am dealing with you as my representative in the UK or in the US, and you do me anything, I can confirm you. I can call my friends who are in the US to, to confirm from them to use the FBI to track you down. I spend my money, I travel to anywhere. That is it. This man that has come to here is such a nice man. I'm looking at his face right here, and there's nothing that has been changing in his face than the real truth what he has been telling me on phone. He is a little bit hot. That is why I told him that I would like to speak with this man. We are here sitting down talking about big business in millions that we want to sign. And I want him to read the agreement to me very well and clearly before I put